course. We will continue with the lockbox configuration in SP. In the last lecture, we have defined house bank in the SP. Let us define lockbox in the SP. So the transaction code to define lockbox in SP is OB10. You can also use the SPRO path, which is SPRO, financial accounting, bank accounting, bank accounts, define lockbox. Log into SAP IDEA system, transaction code OB10. Click new entries. Company code triple zero six lockbox. Let's identify it with LC K B X. So you can give any number or name as lockbox. House bank. We have defined city as the house bank. So let us select city, which is here, and lockbox number. Again, uh, we can give the lockbox number, which is provided by the bank. In this case, uh, for testing purpose, we will give one, two, three, four, five, six, seven as the lockbox number. Enter. So there was already an existing log box with that number. I deleted that and we will define it again. countries US. In the production environment, you have to give the correct complete address. For testing purpose, we are just entering the country as US. Save. So we defined the logbox for the house bank. Now let us define control parameters for the house bank. So control parameters are defined in the transaction code OBAY. You can also use the SPRO path. Control parameters are defined for the logbox procedure now uh, and file format. Now as there are SAP supports two logbox pro, uh, SAP supports uh, one logbox procedure which is logbox and it supports two file formats, which is BAI and BAI2. BAI is an older version where uh, it is the incoming file will not automatically clear the customer open invoices. So BAI2 is the later version. This file has more detail and it not only automatically posts the bank account, it also automatically clears the customer open invoices. So for our configuration and testing purpose, and also for our discussion, we will go with BAI2 format, which is widely used in US. SP comes pre-delivered with the procedure lockbox and the file format BAI2.
So we have the procedure log box and the record format or file format BI2. Let us select. Uh, uh, so in the record format, not for BAI2 format, it's mentioned, which means because we are using the file format BAI2, nothing has to be entered in fields, document number length, number of document numbers in type six, number of document numbers type four. Under the posting, select GL account posting. This will, this will enable the file to do the GL account posting. Select the incoming customer payments checkbox this will en enable the lockbox file to do subledger posting that is the op uh, the bank clearing account will be debited and the customer open invoices will be credited or cleared select insert bank detail uh, once the checkbox is selected in case uh, uh, bank details are missing in the customer master uh, lockbox uh, session will create a batch session and that batch session will update the bank details in the customer master based on uh, bank details like customer routing number account number present in the lockbox file in the next lecture we will go through other steps in lockbox configuration.